Ladies and gentlemen, guys and bells, welcome back to a brand new video. I hope you're all doing absolutely fantastic. And today I have an absolute banger for you. It is the battle of the civics, the ultimate rivalry between two generations of civic. We have the EG6 and the EK9 Honda Civic Type R. So, what is today's video? Well, it is the same as every other battle video that I have done. It is going to be based on three. Uh, scores three uh, challenges three whatever you want to call them it is top speed quarter mile time and half mile time and we're going to be putting them to the test up against one another to see who comes out victorious so if you are excited for today's video make sure to leave a like and subscribe and comment down below what kind of uh, videos or challenges builds battles what you, whatever you want me to do in, in the future I will make it happen for you guys absolutely 100%. So let's dive into today's video. So we're going to be starting off with the EG Civic. And the first thing that we want to do is engine swap. And I don't even have the engine that we need. So we're going to go buy that uh, very, 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 very quickly. We want the VR38 engine. That is the engine that we're putting in the EG Civic. Yes, we are. We are going to be putting some insane power into this. And it's going to be bowel for the ages. So, uh, I will put a timestamp on the screen now to where you should skip to if you want to just see the races. You don't want to see any customization because I know some people don't really care about that. Um, so, skip to that if you just care about the races. Uh, first of all, what wheels are we going to want to put on this Civic? I have not got a clue. Honestly, I think the... Uh, how do you say Watanabe? Watanabe's? I don't know. Watanabe's, they they look pretty damn decent on the Civic. Um, but we're just going to have a look at most of the other uh, the wheels that we have. Uh, obviously, don't want nothing too cambered. Uh, but what about the Valencia B? They don't look too bad. They don't look terrible. I do like some, I do like some Valencia bees. Hmm. T thirty is just too basic. Like, they look good on everything, but they are just too standards. If they'll be honestly, if I wanted to, then they'll be put on every car uh, that I would ever build. Uh, but we don't really want that. Honestly, I think we're gonna go with some uh, what's a Nabes. Question is, what color? What color do we want? Right, do you know what? I'm going to build the rest of the car first and then we'll put wheels on afterwards. I think that's a shout. That does sound like a shout to me. Uh, so what... Wait, let's do the color first. We'll do the color. What color do we want? I'm feeling like a dark bluey gray, maybe. Maybe a purple. Uh, da -da. I think we might... Yeah, we're going to go violet. I quite like the violet on this. Uh, I am just going to stick the bags on real quick, just so we can actually see what it fully looks like. Remember to put your ride height to negative 4.5. Right, let's do some bumpers. What have we got? We've got the Rocket Bunny. Sorry, that's Pandem, sorry, not Rocket Bunny. Um, Fortune, the Tuna. BN, the drag here, and the uh, front lip. Uh, I, I might just go for the standard front lip. I quite like the front lip. Yeah, we're going to go with that. Um, then what else are we going to do? Right, we've got the side skirts. Pandem, Rocket Bunny, uh, Tuna, BN, VX lip. Hmm. I think Rocket Bunny. Rocket Bunny the way to go. Right, and the rear bumper. Let's see what we have. Nothing too crazy. Nothing too exciting. Honestly, I might just keep the stock. Honestly, yeah, I'm just going to keep the stock. Right, let's put the spoilers on. What kind of spoilers do we have? Samurai, Ghost, Street... Uh, that thing, rally wing, the dark. Um, 
I quite honestly I quite like yeah I'm gonna go for the 336 racing wing I do very much like that uh, we're not gonna we're not gonna do seats um, but it is uh, right let's explain the rules um, there is no rules it's a free-for-all max the car best tunes I could find to everything like that I'm gonna put them up to the test um, I decided to change it up from the past battles I did, you know, normally uh, in the Skyline vs. GT, no, not Skyline vs. GT, Skyline vs. Super video, I didn't do an engine swap uh, because it was a battle between the 2J and the RB, uh, but this one, no guts, no glory, we're just going full in, right, so uh, we'll do the NOS, I'll do the wheels in a minute, uh, we're going to put the Ready T60 Diamond Turbo, there's some brakes that don't even do nothing. 76, 350. Alright, we'll put Adam Draxes on. I've already done bags. Intake. Let's do that one. Yeah, we'll do we'll do the regular VX. Open intake. ECU. VX concept X and the VX are black. And uh I'm thinking that we go hood exit. Because, let's be honest, you're going to want a hood exit on a 7 because they just look absolutely insane. Like, you can't, you, honestly, you cannot tell me otherwise. Uh, so don't even try, honestly, don't even try. Right, uh, wheels, let's see what wheels we can rock on this. 20 minutes later. Okay, so I did find a couple of wheels. I did find a couple of wheels that I liked. Uh, let's just go through them real quick. So it was these AV form clips. Uh, these A3 form G's. Uh, where was the other ones? These BBX. Uh, I do kind of like them. Uh, what else were they? These PR Evo X. I think that might have been it. Yeah, right. I actually kind of like this. So we're going to go with the PR Evo X. Right, can't forget the tune. Cannot forget the tune. Uh, so. I'm going to do the tune real quick and I will show you after it is done. All right, guys, this is the tune for the EG6 Civic. Make sure to uh, pause the video or screenshot if you want to use it. Uh, but with that, I believe, I believe it, the, the, the build is done, I think, unless there's anything I've forgotten. So we're going to do a quick dyno tune. Uh, and we're going to see how much sort of power we are pushing. We have a thousand, yes, two thousand, three thousand. Oh, that engine sounds weird. Three thousand one hundred and sixty-seven horsepower. That is a very, very nice number indeed. Okay, so just a, uh, another quick uh, little recap. The uh, categories or the challenges: the top speed, the quarter mile, and the half mile are what we are testing here today. So. I think we start off with the uh, the top speed, see what we can try and get to, and then uh, we'll go on to the quarter mile and the half mile. All right, so let's see what we get. 220 miles an hour. I don't think we can go any more. Two hundred and twenty miles an hour, and we just got absolutely sent by the police. Okay, so that's not that. You know, that's actually pretty decent. Two hundred and twenty miles an hour. We'll mark that down on the scoreboards, um, and then we will jump into the quarter mile drag race. Six point zero. <laughs> Jesus Christ! That is almost as fast as my, uh, the fastest time I've done in my R thirty five Nismo. That is for a first run. That is insane. Ah, I messed up the first gear. But we still get fast. Six point zero seven eight. Oh my God. It didn't register. Uh, okay, I'm gonna do that one again. Uh, for some reason, my emulator that I'm using it sometimes doesn't register uh, that I've pressed a button. 
in this case it's the button I have mapped to uh, upshift. So sometimes it just doesn't register, so. And we get a 6.098. That is honestly insane. Honestly insane. Okay, right, so that is the quarter mile done. Now let's do the half mile and see uh, see what sort of times we uh, can get. Right, Civic versus Aston Martin. We get a 10.583. Now, I haven't done too many uh, half miles um, in well, any car already, so I'm, I'd like to say that's a decent time. I'd like to say this is, I mean, it's the new highest score, so hopefully, hopefully it is. 10.709, not as quick. I did mess up a couple of gears. All right, final run, final run for the, uh, the half mile. And we are up against another EG6 Civic. This is going to be interesting. Of course, we absolutely spoke him. Not really any competition there. Uh, 10.675, not as great. However, we did get a damn good run. Okay, so now it's time for the EK9 Civic. Uh, we're going to modify, customize it, upgrade it, and then put it against its paces against the EG Civic. So, uh, we're going to start off with the bags. Uh, let's slap some bags on there and put that to negative 4.5. And then we'll start off with the visual first and then we will cut to the modification, like the performance, and then we'll do the races. So if you want to just skip ahead to the races, timestamp will be on the screen now. And with that, let's just dive into the uh, customization. Because some of you, I've, I know I've said it a lot of times, but some of you really, really do like the, uh, like the customization and all that. And honestly, saying that, I really like the gold fade on this. I really do. So I think we're going to stick with it. Question is, what sort of wing are we going to want on the Civic? Uh, right, I kind of like I kind of like the ESP wing on this, but also the duck. Okay, right. Uh, I want I do want to see what the 336 looks like. So I'm going to go. A little, a little, a little. I, every video, I cannot speak. I'm so sorry. So we're going to go buy another 336 spoiler. There it is. I'm going to go and slap it on the Civic and see what that looks like. Hopefully it does look decent. And yes, it does. That is very nice. I do like the look of that. So, uh, let's have a look at the front bumpers. So, we've got Pandem, Rocket Bunny, uh, Fortune, Tuna, and the BN. Uh, drag, and just a regular front lip. Honestly, I kind of like the drag one, you know. I honestly, I do like the drag from bumper, so we're gonna go, I'm just gonna slap it on, you know? Slap it on. Right, wide body. Uh, Pandem, Rocket Bunny, Fortune, Tuna, BN, and just a regular lip. Uh, just look through them one more time. Uh, I kinda like Tuna, we'll go Tuna. We'll go, we'll go with the Tuna kit. Right, and the rear bumpers, Pandem, Rocket Bunny, Fortune, Tuna, and BN. Uh, I say Pandem. We'll go, yeah, we'll go Pandem. I do like Pandem. Uh, okay, so wheels. Can't forget the wheels. Uh, let's see what we are going with. Do you know what? I'm going to go back to what I said at the EG. I'm going to put the uh, Watanabe's on. Uh, question is, what colour though? Oh, I don't know. Oh. Uh, right. I am going to... Yeah, I'm going to stick with these T38 SBs. I do... They are uh, looking very nice. They are catching my eye quite a lot. So we're going to go with them. Uh, we're going to put the T60 Diamond Turbo. The brakes that don't do anything. The advent dragsters. Uh, we've already put bags on. Already put them on. Alright, uh, VX open intake. Yes. VX concept X. Yes. 
SF Type R and VX Flux. PXR Black. And uh, do right, do we want to go for another hood X exhaust? Let's go let's go buy another one. Because the only one that we have is currently on the Civic. Well the gold one at least anyway. Right, uh let's see how much that puts us up. 708. Uh do you know what? I'm I'm gonna stick with the max power carbon. Uh now we do obviously well we do want an engine swap. And we do put the LT5 engine inside. Yeah, that's given us a little bit. Alright, this is the tune for the EK Civic. Pause or screenshot now if you want to use it. And uh, without that, uh, sorry, with that out of the way, let's give this a dyno run. Just see what we are pushing. I know you can see it on the um, on, like the stats thing, but I always like to do a dyno tune just in case. 3,776 horsepower. Very nice indeed. Right, let's start off with the cruise and uh, the top speed test. Let's uh, let's let's see what the uh, the EK Civic. Uh, let's see what we'll provide. 211 miles an hour, nine miles an hour slower than the EG Civic, so not as quick. Thank you, Mr. Police Officer. I was trying to slow down. So. 211 miles an hour. Right, let's do the quarter mile now. Let's do quarter mile. Right, so first we get a 6.272. I did mess up on that one again. I messed up a lot of these uh, a lot of these races recently. I don't I have no clue what is going on. So 6.272. I reckon we can go faster than that. So, sorry. Excuse me. A six point zero three nine. Are you serious? No, there's no way. After the EG got uh, what was it six point zero a nine? I thought that would have won. Oh, okay, full start, lovely. Oh look, no, we're up against another Civic. Old school versus new school. Six point one three six. Okay, so that is all three runs done. Uh, the court mile, we got a six. Uh, yeah, six point zero three nine. That is <laughs> incredibly fast. Like, absolutely, uh, I'm, I'm lost for words. To put it simply, I am lost for words. All right, let's try the half mile. We are up against a second gen MR2. Now, I cannot remember what we got in the EG. So I guess we're just gonna have to wait and see. 10.917. I reckon we do faster. I reckon with the timing of the NAS, I reckon that we can do a lot faster than that. 10.866. Again, getting, getting faster, getting faster. Oh no, we're up against another EK. But it's all right, because we are absolutely gonna crop dust him. Give him a first class ticket to Gapistan. I didn't even use NOS. Well, this is a terrible time. Yep. <laughs> right. Oh, well, so we got a 10.866 on that run. And, uh... Honestly, yeah, the EK was a lot better than I thought it would. I honestly thought that the EG would win. I wholeheartedly did believe that. So... Uh, look at the scores. The EG top score of uh, well, its top speed was 220, which beats the EK Civic. However, the EK Civic was faster on the quarter mile, and uh, I forgot to record down the half mile for the EG. So post that in me. Thank you very much. But yeah, let me know in the comments down below which car would you pick over the EG or the EK. Personally, I choose the EG because it is one of my all-time favorite cars. Um, it is well near enough my dream car, tied with. 
the Honda DC5 Integra actually. And with that, that's going to wrap up today's video, guys. So if you enjoyed, make sure to leave a comment down below of uh, what you want me to do in like future videos, different car builds, battles, everything like that. Let me know down below, and I'll be make sure to do it for you. Um, I don't really have anything else to say except for thank you everyone so much for watching. Um, stay safe, take care. Uh, don't do any of the events that you saw in this video, and I will see you in the next one. Tada! I just need a moment to give a little more, to feel a little more before I open my eyes. It feels like I was chosen to give a little more.